A hearing that lasted several hours revolved around one question, whether or not a bar and hotel are operating as one entity. Jackie Roberts was at that long hearing today. She joins us now live from the federal courthouse. Jackie. Hey, Sean, the owners of the hotel attached to the bar at 901 West 4th Street are fighting to reopen. That bar was closed after a judge determined it was a nuisance. But the owners of the hotel are saying they shouldn't be punished because of the patrons of the bar. The decision to shut down the bar comes after several crimes, including shootings and even homicides, took place in or outside the facility. The new ownership group took over around November of 2015. Officers say since then they've opened at least five investigations based on community complaints and police information. Two weeks ago, a judge ruled in favor of the prosecution, ordering to close the bar until further notice. Today, the owners are arguing they should be able to reopen the hotel attached. But investigators say the two are essentially one entity, sourcing documentation including tax records of the bar and hotel being paid for by the same LLC. The property owner at, a, at the hotel says they want the violence to stop too, but forcing them to close is not the answer. We do a lot around there. We're not just no guys out here trying to do nothing sideways. It's a family. They keep saying... Um, it's a family thing. It is a family thing. I have a whole family in Erie, PA. My grandmother, my aunties, my uncles. We're trying to run a legitimate establishment. At this hearing and at the last one, there were several people in the community who came, all expressing their disdain for this organization. However, the owners say again that they do want the violence to stop and they are an asset to the community. But the judge today could not reach a decision, so this case will be picking up again tomorrow at 9.15. Back to you, Sean. Jackie Roberts live at the Erie County Courthouse.